Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm gonna help you with a very annoying issue you probably have when using the Unreal Engine 5 and Lumen to render this type of satin finishes material, these semi-glossy materials, those which are not entirely glossy or matte. You'll probably see in the reflections this noise you can see on screen. I'll help you to remove it so your materials look much better, much more realistic as a result you can see on the right side of the screen. It's hard to remove except if you know this little trick that will transform everything. So let's go now for it. Here you're seeing a, a scene I've created, a dining room scene and there's this table to which I've added this semi-glossy material, this satin material you can see on screen. The noise is very noticeable here in the, the reflection of the panel light, the window and also the reflection of the frame that you have on the wall. It's very noticeable. So we need to remove it to make the scene look much better. One thing to take into account here is that this issue only happens on a range of the spe a specific range on the roughness threshold. It happens for materials that have a roughness, roughness between dot two and dot four or dot five. You can see here if we if we increase the roughness, this noise is not visible at all. Or if we reduce it to make a glossy material, the noise is not visible either. So this issue it's only related to those satin finishes material like you can see here on screen between dot two and dot four roughness let's see how we can fix this it's very easy we need to use this console command i have here written i'll put in the description so you can easily copy it once you do go to your unreal engine interface to the console command box you can see here here this one paste it ctrl v and this value is set by default to 100 but now we're going to put it to only three so type it hit enter and it will be applied to your level editor to your viewports you can see now the materials are now affected the reflections look completely different however they do not look good at all they look incorrect what i'm going to do is to increase a bit the specular of this material instance and reduce the roughness so we can get a result much more similar to what we had before we applied the console command the result looks great look at that the noise is now removed you can see on screen a comparison of how it looked before and how it looks now you can tweak a bit more the, the settings of the material to get uh, exactly the result you want but this time you won't get this horrible it's annoying noise you are getting I recommend you to always apply this magic trick, this console command to your level editor when you are starting to work on your project at the beginning of it because if you don't, if you use it at the end as I've just done most of your materials will look bad, will look incorrect as you see here and you will probably need to compensate them let's try to do this with the floor here in the roughness yeah, it looks better this way. So it, the best is to use it uh, before creating your materials so you can modify it easily. Let's take this back to 100 and you can see how it looked before. It looks with the default value. You can see the noise in here. And if we take it back three, we can create a very realistic material without this noise so that's all guys that's all you need to do to fix this annoying issue on real engine 5 and by the way if you would like to learn how to create this type of stunning scenes for archbis 
how to create stunning animation and interactive experiences, you can go to our site EliteRendersAcademy.com. There you will find Unreal Engine 5 courses. You have a training to learn to create this type of stunning animations and interactive experiences. And I recommend you to register to our site so you can have special discounts on our courses. So thanks for watching guys and see you soon.